Hello friends, this video is about installation, setup and configuration of SS email, station satcom email software in this new computer. This email software will work with the VSAT on board on a tanker vessel. So let's get started. To install this software, first you need to download this software from the service provider website. You need to go to their website and they will give you the username and password to download this software. Now the downloading is started. So it will take a while to download this file in your system. Once it's downloaded, then you need to extract these files in your system. And then the installation is very easy. Just follow the on-screen instructions and then just click next, next, next to install this software in your computer. Now, as you can see, the download is completed, is almost completed. And you will see their icon appearing on the desktop. So let's close everything and double click on the, on the software. The username and password will be provided to you by your service provider. Once this is done, then you have to set up the terminals you are using to use the software. So in my case, we have a, uh, we are using it with two terminals. We are using it with VSAT on board and then VSAT needs to be connected with TCP IP. And then the other terminal is FBB fleet broadband terrain and terrain. So now I'm configuring the terrain and terrain terminal so actually it's a mistake connect it configure the two terminals so need one needs to be deleted so once this is done then you can just click on connect all and if everything goes then you can launch the web mail version of the software and then use your email address and password to log in and once this is done then you need to send a test email to make sure everything is working The good thing about this software that this uh, web email you can just use it for configuration and then you don't need to use it you can configure the ms outlook so that one i will show you how to do it in a moment so just let's send a test email first using the web mail Now keep in mind that if you are swapping the computer and then it may not work because the you have to uninstall the 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 software from the old computer first okay now let's go to control panel 
and email to configure the outlook just follow the on screen instructions to to set up the outlook that will work with this email system and then also test your account settings once everything is good then you can close everything and then go to your outlook and from here you will see that emails will start appearing in your inbox just keep in mind that in two places you cannot configure this software it will not work otherwise your emails will disappear now i'm sending an email from the outlook to confirm it's working actually when you send email from your outlook it may it will not go but it will show you in your send box so after the email show you in your send box then you have to minimize the outlook and go to the gmail uh, sorry gmail software and then you need to connect it so you have two ways of connecting the software either from wechat or fpb now let's time to go on board to fix this computer this is the vessel you are seeing on your screen this is the wechat dish wechat modem and this communication computer can work with the wechat this is the wechat on board and in case the wechat is having issues then the computer can also work with the satellite phone fpb fleet broadband so the crew needs to change the lan cable this is the lan cable for the satellite phone and then the wechat cable is connected so now everything is good